Daisy friends, Julie Deal Mooney here today to do an unboxing of my Cocoa Daisy kits. Um, this is for March of 2020, and so here is my little box that came in the mail with all its cute little polka dots on it. So let's flip it over, get it ready. But before we do that, um, I'm just going to show you a few things that I have around my desk. Um, I have an acrylic tray, got it from Amazon. I'll link it in the notes. Um, and that's what I'll be putting my stuff in as I take it out and look at it. Um, I have three little, they're almost like little pots. They had tops to them. And I'll be using those to store my die cuts in. And then I have a book ring, just a big book ring that I'm going to put my washi on. I did that this past month and I liked it a lot. And then I have this green um, Carpe Diem, Clover is the name of the color, uh, planner. And so I have just a piece of acetate in there uh, in preparation. And then I have just five blank dividers in mine, just so that the minute I put my inserts in it, it has structure. And I just made these on my silhouette. And um, I went ahead and if you've watched any of my videos, I make swatches for each month for Cocoa Daisy. And then I just print out some of the pictures of the kits because I look at it and decide which weeks I'm going to use on the Daisy Dory. And then I do some patterns. So um, that's what I have as far as planner goes. I also have this super cute yellow polka dotted um, zippered sticker pocket for my stickers. So I'm going to use that. I love that. It's so bright and cheery, the green and yellow. And then I have pulled a few things, just some um, ribbons, some rickrack, some shaker kind of things that are all green. It looks very kermity in this box. And then a little bit of floss. And I will probably pull some other stuff. Um, I've spent the last couple of weeks organizing my craft room. So it's a whole lot easier to get to now. So I can pull it all at the last minute. So I just had that pulled before I got it all organized. So yeah, so my ribbons and my clips are all out on their, their artwork and they are organized on the wall. So they're easy for me to get to. They're not in a box somewhere they have to get them out. So let's get started with the box. So I love the Coco Daisy packaging, the pretty yellow box with the polka dots. It also helps, oops, I didn't do the sides. If um, you're looking, if you go to the post office early like I did last time and ask them to look for it for you, it's easier if you tell them it has yellow polka dots all over it. It's it easier fun. And then it has yellow polka dotted tissue paper on the other side. So, like I said, this is for March of 2020, and the name of the kits are Treetop Canopy, and all of the artwork is from Linus Spots, and um, just really cute sloth and llama and rainforest type things. So on the back, Christine uh, writes a few paragraphs on how she picked this and the color and what she was thinking about, and so um, that's always interesting to read. So there is the treetop canopy card. I'm gonna put that in my tray over here. Okay, so let me um, get the kits all pulled out and we will start with the planner kit. Okay, here is the planner kit for this month and it just seems like there's so much stuff in it. So um, I will start over here with the washi. Um, I do take everything out of the bags before I start showing it to you. So it's not technically an unboxing, um, but I don't like the way that crinkly stuff sounds while I'm filming. So, sorry, this is taking forever. So this is really cute. This is that little sloth and he goes upside. So there's no uh, right side up, right side down. It goes back and forth and that's really cute. And then it's got a blue background with little random dots. So that is super cute. And then this little paper clip with the llama on it. How adorable is that? That's really cute too. Little beads. Very cute. And then the packaging this month has um, palm fronds on it. Or bamboo. This looks more like bamboo, I suppose. And... Um, so you can always do things with that. It's a great pattern paper or that little stripe, that watercolor stripe at the top. Both of those are things that you can use. 
And then there is a sticky note that says, take it slow with the sloth on it. And then the notepad says, you got this, no problema. How cute is that? That's super cute. All right, and then the pen is really pretty. It's like a uh, tealish aqua with teal crystals in the center. And as always, you can never see this on film, but the barrel itself has a little shimmer to it. I don't know if you can see that on film or not. I might have it too close. So yep, yeah, that's really pretty. And then a, a couple of extra um, pen refills. And then an assortment of die cuts with words and images, um, and then goals of the week, goals of the day, and goals of the month. And then the tabs for dividing up your planner in several different uh, colorways. So those are really cute. So I'm going to put those in my little tubs over here on the side based on their words and pictures. And if it's pictures and words, then it goes in pictures and tabs. And then these are, um, I'm, I did not take these out of the packaging. If you've never gotten the rub-ons before, don't take them out of the packaging until you're ready to use them. And when you're ready to use them, cut the part out that you want to use and rub that on. Don't try to rub on with the whole sheet, like cut out what you need and then do the rub on. And there is a uh, popsicle stick in the back for you to rub them on with or you can use the back end of a pen or whatever you happen to have handy. Um, so yeah, these are really cute. Okay, and then I love green. I really do. Green is one of my favorite colors. Um, and this bright lime and, well, this is more like a chartreuse, the tassel, and then the lime pom-poms are just so cute. So it says reading gives us some place to go when we have to stay where we are. That's true. I am certain there are good things to come. Oh, I hope so. So yeah, so that's really cute. Pouch to put all your stuff in. And then we have some stickers. We have this sheet that has smile. Your box of happy is here. Let's see. Oh, change clocks because daylight savings is coming. Cleaning list, coffee date, reading list, cocoa daisy reveal day, doctor appointment, weekend off and go. Those are really cute. And then these are the stickers that fit perfectly on these tabs. And so they have divider words, and then they have a few that are blank so that you can um, put your own on there if you don't use those. And then these are numbers and days of the week and little tiny stickers and then little small headers. So yeah, a lot of stickers on that sheet. And then this one has icons, and then there's a couple more tabs here. You can either, if you didn't, like if you wanted the color, this green color rather than this color, you could cover it because they are exactly the same size. Or if you're willing to have your um, tab be not quite as strong as the cardstock, you could just fold the sticker over and use that there. And so then right down here on the bottom, there, let me get my hand, I can't seem to get my hand in the right spot. Um, there are a lot of holidays listed down here. So we've got International Women's Day, Daylight Savings, St. Patrick's, Spring Equinox, Passover, and Palm Sunday. And then same here, some stickers for holidays and then appointments and stuff. All right, so those are the stickers from the planner kit. And then we have the planner papers, which are six, uh, eight and a half by 13 folded in the middle. Ooh, that's pretty. And then there's a scene on one side and the bamboo on the other. And then this one, which somehow makes me think of kiwi, but really cute. And then this one is just a little coral pattern. And then there is a wooden one, it's kind of a tribal looking pattern. And then some uh, little triangles going back and forth on a blue field. So those are very pretty. And then we have the loose inserts. So I get both the looser inserts and the Daisy Dory. The loose inserts actually come with my planner kit and then I get the Daisy Dory on the side. And both of mine are A5. So. 
you'll get to see both of them. Um, so you can compare and contrast. So loose inserts, it has this divider page to get you started with. And then five of these color block pages. And it Lama Stay, Sky Above, Earth Below, Peace Within. That's cute. And then um, five weekly spreads that all look the same. So this is what the weekly spread looks like for the loose inserts. And so this is just a repeat of those. So I'm just going to pull all those by. And there's one more, I think. And then there is a notes page that is the back side of the monthly spread on two pages. I love having that page. And then this year at a view uh, each month. And then there are a bunch, I've said this before, I think there are 31 daily to do pages. And so they are two-sided. They're meant to work as a spread so that that's one day, that's Monday and Monday, two, two, days, two page spread for each day. And that this more than anything else was what made me decide to subscribe to Coco Daisy initially because I need a daily to do page. Like it's just like before I did what I would call planning, I still planned and it was a daily to do list every day. And I always had a daily to do list. So I may not plan that far in advance back then, but I always had a daily to do list. So this is the Daisy Dory. It comes in a craft cover and it is stapled on the spine. I do take it and cut it right down the middle and then I punch it. I punch these and I punch this. Um, I get this unpunched just because my pu the punch that I have is a little bit different. The, the placement of the holes is slightly different than Coco Daisy's. And so if I try to line the pages up when I'm putting, if I'm having to be putting two back to back, the holes don't line up and it drives me nuts. So I just punch them all myself. It takes five minutes, no big deal. So there is a month on one page. There's a beautiful line two page spread. And then there are, um, I think of these as weekly spreads. And so each one of these looks different in this book. Oh yeah, these are cute. And so then there's some open pages that you can do whatever you would like with. And then at the back of the book, it goes back to weekly spreads again. So I just pick out four of these spreads that I like and I use those for my weekly spreads. Let this be the day you leap into the life you're meant to live. Cute. Take a step back, breathe, refresh, and restart. And I always like this back page. The artwork on this back page is always so cute. So there are the loose in inserts and the Daisy Dory. So that is the planner kit. So if you'll hang tight, I'll be right back with the planner add-on kit. Okay, let's do the planner add-on kit. So, um, all of this stuff comes in the planner add-on kit. So I'll start over here with the cards. This one's really cute. I'm not napping, I'm just taking a horizontal life pause. So that one's four by six. And then we have a three by four with the color swatches. Uh, three by four, Wake Up Beauty, It's Time to Beast, and Llama Stay. Very cute. All right, I'm gonna put those in my tray over here. And then I have um, stickers here. So we have deco stickers. Sorry, they're stuck together. Then days of the week, which there are five weeks worth of these days of the week and small checklists. And then alphas and numbers and some small icons in between. And then yes, toucan, that's very cute. Um, and then some more deco stickers. Okay, I'm gonna put those with my sticker. And then the stickers and the pocket cards came in this glassine bag. I save those. Um, I don't use them every month, but when I want to use a glassine bag, I always have them. So um, yeah, and if you need to put a cookie in a bag or anything else, you can always come grab those too. Although you never know where they've been, but you know, whatever. Um, look at this, how cute is this? This um, 
chain to hang on the outside of your planner this month. So that's kind of different and a lot of fun. So I like that. I'll put that over there with my llama. And then we have a green lapin. I like the way these pins write. And then the washi is a floral with a pink background. Very cute. And I just love that chartreuse green color with pink. That's one of my favorite color combinations. And then we have deco puffy stickers with some dots and some pluses. And then we have three embroidered, uh, they're kind of like patches. They have adhesive on the back of them so you can stick them wherever you want to. Very cute, a toucan, a monkey, and a llama with a sloth. And then we have die cuts. So we have all of these over here that have um, words and pictures. And then this one that says weekend. And then we have some tabs. I'm gonna take those and put them in their little tubs. All right, so I will put this away. And then the next thing we will look at is the dashboards. All right, we're back with the dashboards and there are two sets of dashboards in the dashboard kit. There is the A5 size and the personal size and they, the artwork is exactly the same, just the dimensions of it are different. So this one says March, has a little monkey hanging from a tree. Wherever you are, be all there. Oh, that's nice. I really like that. That's really cute. <laughs> Llama need no drama. That's really cute. They're really cute. Find time. Find the time to relax. That's cute. Anywhere with a good book is my happy place. And then hang in there. Oh, how cute is that? Got the little monkey hanging and the sloth hanging. Very cute. So those are the dashboards. So if you'll hang in there, I'm going to grab the sticker kits and we will look at all of those. Okay, I subscribe to three sticker kits. I get the classic planner sticker kit, the planner sticker kit, and the Daisy add-on sticker kit. And each kit up in the corner the top right hand corner, it tells you which sticker kit it is. So that helps you if you're like, which stickers am I using the most? You can look up to see which ones are left. So the classic planner sticker kit and the planner sticker kit are very similar. Um, the size of the boxes are a little bit different. They're the same width, but the classic planner sticker kit boxes are taller. They are the size of a classic happy planner. The planner sticker kit are the size boxes of an Erin Condren. Um, but the width is the same for both of them. So they do have um, deco boxes and pattern boxes on both of these. So I'm going to look at these together at the same time. So you've got sheets of deco boxes and then um, you have an extra sheet in the classic planner sticker kit of deco boxes with boxes at the bottom and then the planner sticker kit kind of makes up for that with two sheets of clipboards and boxes and hydrate stickers whereas this one just has the one sheet of clipboards and trackers And then they're not quite in the same order. So they both have a sheet of headers and weekend stickers and uh, checklists. And once again, the length of them is different, but everything else kind of the same. The icons are a little bit different sized here. This one has deco, this has weekend banners. These have banners, these have kind of different banners, but it's very similar pages. Um, and then the classic planner sticker kit has words and deco, whereas the planner sticker kit has hexagons and smaller boxes. And these fit on, if you have an A5, these fit on the monthly page. And then each of these kits has a, oh wait, the classic planner sticker kit has alphas and faux washi. 
And then each of them has a transparent sticker page. The planner sticker kit has washi and uh, watercolor washes. And the classic planner sticker kit has word art and some faux washi. So those are those two kits. So then we have the Daisy add-on sticker kit. So there is a sheet with deco on it. And it's got this little piece of, oh, that's so cute. It's like circles. That's really cute. And then it has a lot of boxes. Some of them are like frames and some of them are like tabs and some are like arrows, but really cute. And then a sheet of navy blue alphas with numbers. Love, 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 love that. And then some word art. So there we go. So those are my three sticker kits that I subscribe to. So next I'll be moving on to the um, memory keeping kits. So Okay, here is the Traveler's Notebook Memory Keeping Kit. So look at all these goodies. So let's start off with the washi here. So it is a rainbow stripe that doesn't repeat for a good long while. That's real cute. So it goes through the whole rainbow. That's super cute. Let's see if I can get that rolled back up. And then we have um, stamps, which are like a pattern. So you can do like a border on the edge of your page, or you can repeat it, make a whole background. That would be cute. You can make some really cute backgrounds with this. That's real cute. And then, um, I love these. These are like a little um, pocket, a little clear pocket. And this one says some of the best things in life. And so um, you can use pocket for whatever you would like. And then there's a nice craft tag, which is just a little blank artboard ready for you to make something with it. And then as always, there are the gorgeous um, glitter dots. And then we have a set of lime green uh, alphas. And then this is fun. We have a set of black um, cursive rub-on alphas. So the uh, popsicle stick is in the back so that you can rub them on. So I've never done rub-on alphas before. So that's a lot of fun. Love new and I love new and different things. Okay, so um, I'll get, go ahead and take these and get them out of the way. So we have all these die cuts. We have these cute leaves and arrow and marker spots and arrow and tab. And then lots of words. This spring is sprung is really pretty in March. Fresh air, so much fun. So these are really cute. I'll just take all the words. It's just so much easier if I sort them while I'm doing the unboxing. Otherwise, I have to go through all of them and, um, and sort them. Okay. And then these are new. They're, we've had them for a couple of months. They're kind of like dashboards for your traveler's notebook. So this one's real cute. It says, hello, March. We have one that says, good eats. Top 10. Oh, that's cute. Ooh, cool. Okay. Yay. That's really cute. And those are all cute. Okay, and then we have a set of chipboard stickers. So those are really cute and they are adhesive on the back so you don't have to put any adhesive on them. Let me get that in the tray over here. And then we have a simple dory, which is a traveler's notebook um, that's made for memory keeping. So there's pattern and a blank page and then some blank pages. So it's a little bit different than the Daisy Dory, which is more of a planner type Dory. This is more of a memory keeping type Dory. 
and I just really like all the stuff in the Traveler's Notebook Memory Keeping Kit. So a lot of times I will deconstruct this book and use it um, for the paper, like that one right there. That's really cute. Especially if I'm going to make something like an envelope, which is, you know, easier to make out of a um, flimsier paper than the Cocoa Daisy paper, because it is pretty thick. Oh, that's pretty, too. And I always look through this and think, oh, these papers are so pretty, and, and they're not in any of the other kits. And then I look through the memory keeping papers, and they're in there. So um, they probably are. So the memory keeping papers are slightly, well, they're, you know, slightly smaller than half of the um, uh, planner papers. They are six by eight and a half. Um, so we have a nice blue plaid and with a dark green bamboo. And then we have this fading plus symbol cross. That's pretty. And then that, that is such a pretty pattern. And then this stripe that has a little bit of a herringbone in it. And then see, there's that spatter spark. Oh, that's pretty. And then they repeat. You get two pieces of each of the papers. And then this was behind the Puffy Alpha set. And this piece is the same size as a piece of paper. So you really could use this in your planner. You could just cover this part up, up here and do something with it. If you want to do something with that, that's really cute. So there are those. All right, if you'll hold on just a second, I will get the Modern Memory Keeping kit. Okay, here we are with the Modern Memory Keeping Kit. And I just have to show you these first because they are so cute. It's like little teeny, teeny, tiny bulldog clips. Two of them are bronze and one of them is gold. They're so stinking cute. Look at them, you pinch them and they open up. Those are so cute. I've never seen those before. All right. Uh, next thing, let's look at the die cut so that I can get them off. Um, so we've got words. We've got some circles. We've got some things that you can write on. A think big flag. A few little um, just shapes. And then one little leaf in there. So those are all really cute. So I'm going to pull the words. Occasionally I've done this and I put them in the wrong bucket and then I'm so sad because then I have to sort them out. Okay, all those go in the same. Okay, and then let's move on to the stamps. So we have, um, let's see, it's an extra cup of kind of day. Rest, refuel, recharge, a little leaf. Every day is a new beginning. And taking naps sounds so childish. I prefer to call them horizontal life pauses. And then that ooh, cool, and okay, yay. And then it's okay to take it slow. These are all really cute. Very cute. And then we have another set of glitter dots. And then, oh my goodness, these are so cute. Okay, so I'll pull them up and get them closer for you. So um, it's two more of the craft tags. So there are three of those total if you get both the Traveler's Notebook Memory Keeping Kit and the Modern Memory Keeping Kit. Two in the Modern Memory Keeping Kit. But then these are acetate with white writing on them. So there's another perfect day, all smiles, this moment. And then... Feel the warmth of the sun and let's just relax. Those are so, so cute. So those are the kind of thing that I put back in the packaging because I don't want to lose them. Um, And then let's go through the cards. So we have one that says March 2021 and then spring has arrived on the back. And then this one says positive mind, good vibes, great life. And then it's got the numbers and the days of the week on the bottom. So those are the, both of the four by sixes. So these are the three by fours. So everything is a new beginning. Weekends are for napping. Oh, that's pretty. Life is short. Take more pictures. 
totally worth the trouble. Bon Appetit. This is my favorite place, living our best story. Every morning you have a new opportunity to become a happier version of yourself. March stories, and then March calendar. Oh, and just a color, the stripes, and then a shamrock. So let's look at the back. So it says, oh, lucky me. And just some journaling, the calendar. One calendar starts on Monday, one starts on Sunday. Mental note, ins and outs of daily life. Make it happen, that one's really cute. Hold that thought. Drink starters, mains, and dessert up. That's on the back of the Bon Appetit, yep. Daily log, oh, that's cute. You can keep a log of something. Status update. Weekend plans, and every day is a new beginning. So those are the cards. And then we have a brown puffy alpha set. And then we have another one of the uh, cursive rub-on alphas. And then there is another set of chipboard stickers. These are different than the other ones. It's really cute. And then we have another set of uh, memory keeping papers. And there are two sets in this as well. And so it's two-sided, the stripes, and the color wash, and the blue plaid, and the green, dark green bamboo, and then the crosses that fade away, and then that little green and pink stripe pattern. And then the last thing that we have in this kit are the instruction sheets from Christine. Um, and so these can just get you started on doing different layouts. And so... Oh, got instructions to do. I think it's three or four different layouts. So that is the Modern Memory Keeping Kit. So let me get my little acetate pieces back in their packaging. And we will start on the classified kits. So if you do not want to see what's in the classified kits, it's time for you to look away. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe. Okay. Um, all those people who want to be surprised by their classified kits... I love them, but I don't get it because I want to know what's in mine. I always look at the pictures online to see what's in it. So this is the Planner Classified Kit. So let's see what's in there. Anything else? All right. So here is the button that goes on top of the magnetic button clip, and it says, just relax. Just relax. And then there is a cute, uh, is that a sloth? I do this every time. There are little critters in these things. I have no idea what they are. Um, an embroidered paper clip, and he's drinking coffee. I think it's a sloth. Um, and then we have some die cuts. So this is different because I normally don't have to put them out for you, but like I normally do it before I would get on camera. Oh, it's lots of these little monkeys and the sloth and, oh, these are super cute. And there are lots of them. And the toucan and the lizard, that little cup of coffee. There we go. Lots of die cuts. <laughs> there we go. Lots of die cuts. Okay, those are all pictures. Well, okay, people, we need to use die cuts this month because there are a lot of them. All right, so just because I'm awake at 8 a.m. doesn't mean I'm ready for things. Look how cute that is. And look, Christine's coffee cup is the big one. She must be the one that drinks most of the coffee. How cute is that? That's very cute. I made a pot of coffee today at work. I'm the only one in my building. And I made a pot of coffee this afternoon because I wanted a cup of coffee. And then I forgot to drink it and had to pour it out before I left. That was just so wasteful. And it made me sad. So there are deco stickers. Very pretty. And then days of the week stickers. 
very pretty. And then more deco stickers that are very pretty. So we have lots and lots of cute stickers. And then there is another other oh, two of two more of these pockets. I think outside the box and then the palms. So yeah, pockets galore this month. And then this vellum wowzer. Sorry, I'm distracted on my housekeeping over here. But this vellum is green vellum. How pretty is that? That's just gorgeous. All right, so that is the planner classified kit. So hang tight just a minute and I'll grab the um, memory keeping classified. All right, here is the memory keeping classified kit. I'm gonna open it up. And even though I look at the pictures, I can't ever remember what all's in this stuff until I see it. So, okay. Let's see what's in here. This is another glassine bag full of goodies. <sighs> Little wooden pieces. Oh, and acrylic pieces. Memories and together. And little leaves. And <gasps> that little Look at this little heart. It says loved in really tiny letters. Can you see that? So cute. Oh yeah, all of those are so adorable. Love that. Once again, I'll save the glassine bag. Put those all in with that. All right, and then we have labels. I like these labels. Hey, I'm fascinated by this next one. But I gotta pull out the labels first. Lots of colorful labels to write on. Or to just use as um, decoration. They work great for both of those. Wow, this is a nice kit. <gasps> Oh, it's already cut out. I was looking at these numbers and I was looking at the size of this and I thought, how are there number stickers in there? But they're not there. Loose. Look at that, how cute. And so it looks like some of them are blue and some of them are green and some of them are kind of in between. That's really cute. I think I need another little tub because I'm not really sure which category these fit in. I will put them in one. I think I'll put them in the tabs. I don't know why. Okay, and then, ooh, these are, um, we had these tags like this in last month's kit. They were really cute. Remember this. Look at these. these they're so, so cute. Very cute. And then we have a set of alpha stickers. Oh, and look, that was so smart. Okay, so whoever designed these, shout out to you because it's dark to light and then when they turn it upside down, it's still dark to light. So they're all dark to light when you stick them down. Super nice, makes me happy. And it's uppers and lowers, which I really like too. And then in the memory keeping classified kit, there is a set of planner papers. And so it's the bamboo and then the scene. The one I'm calling the kiwi and the coral hash marks and then the tribal wood pattern and the triangles on a blue field. So there you go. There are all of my kits unboxed. It was a gorgeous, gorgeous kit. I can't wait to start using it. Um, I've got a few things to do so I won't be able to start for a week or so. But um, 
it's nice to have it in my craft room ready to go. So I hope you enjoyed that. Let me know if you have any questions. Thank you so much. And if you like the video, please hit the like button and subscribe and hit the notifications bell so you'll be notified when I post again. Thanks so much and have a great day. Bye-bye.